getting ready to run up to the bank, but that was, I think, like a $4,200 one. Um, probably going to profit like, what, 1300 I think, real close. It'll be over over a grand. Nice. But you that profit? Was, yeah, that was uh, free because I wasn't even, I'm not even running ads to that brand. It was a Winchester. Nice. So, so, Johnny. You say. So, how did you get started with e commerce? Well, I ever since I was just a just a young young kid, I kind of knew I wanted to do, you know, I wanted to do something online. I wanted to run an online business, but I didn't know what, you know, I didn't I didn't know nothing about it. Yeah. So I started by buying courses and wasting money and learning, and then finally I found a decent course. And through that course, I met Marcus. They dropped that course. I was actually All right. one of Marcus' first, first students, right? Yeah. <laughs> then he helped me and just kind of was, was there for me every every step of the way. And uh, through all that, I uh, finally met Trevor, and Trevor kind of guided me and stuff and started to uh, – started to make some sales but it's been definitely been been a long journey and it's a forever journey brother but yeah in terms <laughs> yeah so but in terms of like how do your numbers look in the very beginning like for me i started like low ticket drop shipping and then i made like 200k a month in rev then i lost it all because of chargebacks and then i had to get it back all from like high ticket, what 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 was the timeline of your numbers and how was your Shopify journey? Well, I I started out. I started like you said. I started. I got a got a few orders, but they never. You know, they I lost them because I just I didn't know what I was doing, yeah. and like I was actually with with one course that was actually low ticket, and that that went bye bye because. <laughs> they never worked out for me <laughs> and then I actually started getting some orders and then I you know I started I was I was losing losing more money than I was making and then then actually I got on a few calls with with uh, Marcus and he helped me out and we just kind of went back and forth did it did quite a few calls here and there and he really really was there for me every every step and then and help me, you know, just understand understand the business model and just kind of how it works, and you know what the back, basically what you know what supports the business, the the backbone of the business, and then it went. I went from losing money to to making money. So I really really appreciate what they what they did and what they're doing. So it's awesome. I love it. Nice. So yeah, we start low ticket drop shipping. Learned a little bit about high ticket drop shipping from somewhere we're not gonna name, and then kind of was just lost in a little bit for for high ticket. And uh, definitely want to elaborate a little bit about like, so like we've been we know each other for a very long time. But if we're gonna be honest, I think Trevor deserves a huge recognition because uh, Trevor really helped you bring your store. Uh, to the moon he gave extra hours when when he didn't need to um certainly like you know i was there as well but you know trevor in your opinion if you could elaborate what did you see you know when johnny came into our coaching program what were some of the problems and then how did we just go about to fixing it and, and you know where we're at now and our goals for him long term yeah so good question i think the biggest levers that johnny did was really learning the ads and suppliers. Those were the two big ones. Because before I remember his store was kind of kind of broad, right? We kind of yeah. reshift the domain and we got a new domain that's a lot more niche down. So that mm -hmm. that was like step number one. We niche down the store and then we also the brands that we tested, we kind of found that because of shipping, a lot of them weren't profitable. So we kind of find a new product angle that we could find more suppliers. Uh, and get those onto the store. And fast forward to one to two months later, Johnny found a few good suppliers where 
you know, they're making profits and they were getting a good return ad spend. And he's able to, you know, scale those brands profitably while also testing new brands. So I think uh, in the past few weeks calls with Johnny on the group calls, I think Johnny said to everyone that like, you know, trust in the process, just get more suppliers, yeah. run ads, and like you just optimize it. Like that's that's really the two things Johnny has been working on. And like, it doesn't get any more, you know, more difficult or, you know, crazy than that. Like he just got more suppliers, better suppliers, you know, got rid of the old ones and then ran ads. And then right now, what the next move for Johnny is like, he has sales. We just have to get the back end, you know, correct, corrected. And then we can scale the store to, you know, what, what are your numbers so far? Like last month and this month. So last month, uh, we did 38, 38,000 in sales. So, Forty forty thousand dollar month, and then this this month, I'm not sure what we did this month. I think it was like forty eight hundred in sales so far. But uh, we actually just earlier today, I had a customer call and I sent out an invoice for about twenty uh, k. So hopefully that'll be coming in. So that'll run it up to about I don't know twenty thirty k, and that's only about. A week into the into june so hopefully be getting close to 50 to 70k by the end of the month and johnny real quick for you as an entrepreneur what do you see yourself in maybe the next five years for me i uh i definitely I want to, I see myself, I guess, owning, you know, you know, you, are you talking as far as you, you know, like, uh, just business and such? It's your world, bro. Whatever comes to mind. So for me, I, I don't know. I, I guess I see myself, you know, owning, owning multiple, multiple brands and, you know, just building them out. And I'd like to, you know, eventually have a few you know real estate houses probably mm -hmm. take you know what i make from from my from my brands and you know invest some of that into into real estate yeah and like i'm actually like in the near future actually i want to build out another website for for these same suppliers and just you know just continue to continue to do that i guess just build build websites and build out the brand and continue on yeah it's a never it's a never ending game cycle whatever you want to call it but johnny last question and you could be you know truth we have nothing to hide um do you recommend the peak flow coaching program oh without a doubt 100 percent. it's probably it's not probably but it's absolutely one of the best the, and the only only course that i have you know found that's that's this good and has this this great of support and just i guess you know everything in the course it's it will show you every single step like from a to z and back like it's there and if you have if you have any if we you know if we have any questions the the group is there you know the the calls are there it's it's awesome i was actually one of marcus's first students and actually one of his very very first uh one-on-one -on -one students where he actually coached me one-on-one -on -one. and then we went from there and he started building out his uh building out the 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 course and it's it's really good and it's it's even getting better and trevor's always always there for us no matter what if we have a question he's always there to answer it so it's definitely definitely something to be joining i've spent multiple thousands of dollars in courses and stuff and like like we said earlier the one the one of them they just dropped us and you know didn't didn't give yeah. no didn't give no warning or anything 
and was this we're here you know i know marcus and trevor and all of us were here for the long run so it ain't like you're gonna buy it and you're gonna get dropped so it's definitely definitely worth it to me and also i guess you know with with you know with my life from you know growing up you know seeing where i come from the things that you know changed and the the people i've met and just just everything honestly i i just you know give all all glory and thanks to my my lord and savior jesus christ because if it wasn't for him you know i wouldn't be here and it's it's just it's truly been a blessing to work with you guys and be in the course and just just everything about it i love it and i just really appreciate it all you guys do thank you bro like thank you for the kind words uh it really means a lot yeah have you have you found like you know i know the community is you know relatively small but have you found other people to kind of talk about you know the business with because business is definitely lonely like it's just a lot yeah. of times just yourself working at the computer we found any you know other uh guys inside the program you know have you talked with them and what's your experience with that i haven't too much uh looked into that i guess mm -hmm. i haven't I've, I've talked to a few guys in, in the chat I, I should probably you know communicate with them a little bit more than i do mm -hmm. and that's just that's just my my own fault because you know if if you want to chat you can chat there's people in there that are going to talk with you and you know people that want to learn something and people that you can you can talk with and learn from and so it's definitely 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 good yeah facts like our mission you know is to build a network of high level individuals like all of us right now like we're working hard towards our goal in pursuit of you know, a better life, whatever that is we choose. And, you know, part of my goal, and I know Trevor's is we want to gather as many people, you know, like you, Johnny, like all of us, you know, we just trying to get out of the system. We're trying to find freedom. We're trying to just find something more than what we were told from society. Right. And so thank right. you so much for sharing. Thank you so much for sharing your story. Um, I'm sure a lot of people could relate to you. We, I think we all came, like something all three of us have in common is, we started business like we took a leap of faith in ourselves into drop shipping. Then we went through it for a mad long time, probably like didn't find the most success. Then we stumbled onto high ticket and then it's could undoubtedly change all of our lives. I would have never met yes. like, neither of you if it wasn't for high ticket, if it wasn't for this business model. I, I think, you know, for me, I, I thank God, I thank the universe, I thank everything for having, you know, just a chance to have met both of you. And um, let's just continue growing together until the next call. Let's see how far we've grown. And if you guys have anything left to say, you know, now it's just mm -hmm. so, yeah. yeah. I'm excited because you no, know, I could definitely see Johnny in a uh, you know three to six months. We might do another large call when he hits 100k a month. That would be a huge milestone to celebrate. Let's uh, keep working, keep grinding, and that's definitely a possibility, Johnny. You you have what it takes. You know, I'm here. Marcus is here. Um, community is here to just help you grow. Awesome guys. I appreciate it. And, uh, we'll see you guys on the, in the future calls and appreciate everything you guys do and just, uh, good luck to all you guys and let's continue on. Awesome. Let's get it. All right. Peace. Peace. Yep. See ya.